Hello, good evening. How is everybody today? Are you surviving the heat? It's been quite warm here in the UK today. Apparently we're in another heat wave, which is fantastic. But it's not as bad as it was, so it's that, I suppose. <laughs> Hello, you're not on screen. Oh, what can you see? Can you hear me? Oh, there you are. Oh. Oh, good. It's still working, is it? <laughs> well, I have sort of I had to refresh the stream for a second. Oh, okay, cool. I have sort of installed stream elements, but I haven't really done a lot with it yet. But um, hopefully, uh, you can see it. It's and... early yet. Move along, my chair. <laughs> you make the place look crowded. Oh, hey, Anastasia. Welcome in. And hello, JP. Hope you're both doing well. Um, but yeah, hopefully it's all working. Hey, Bestianas. Hey. <laughs> yeah, so today we're going to be continuing with TR3. We are currently in the South Pacific. We didn't finish the first level last time, but we got quite far. So uh, let me just jump over to the game. Here we go. Let me know if you can see it and hear it okay. And we will get started. Yeah, I hope you're both good, uh, JP and Anastasia. Let me know how you're doing today. Everything okay? Okay, great. Yeah, so we got all the secrets last time, because there's four out of three in this level, which is very sneaky. So, uh, all we've got to do now is finish the level, if I can remember how to do it. I sort of do. Oh yeah, we've got to try and get into the treehouse, because there was a an Australian guy calling our name. Or not our name, he was calling us Sheila. <laughs> hey you, Sheila, up here! Oh, I was going to say, how do you open that? But it opened itself. <laughs> Everything okay? Okay, great. Uh, doing good, thank you. Hope you are as well. Yeah, okay, thanks, Anastasia. I saw some friends today, which was really nice. Uh, uh, did some video editing. Um, and I've been working on a new logo for my Twitch, which I might show everyone later. Ouch. If I don't get clubbed in the head by this man. Um, I've got a few designs I want to show off to people, uh, and I think, hopefully, I'll have it all sorted by the time I do my 100 followers celebration stream, so, yeah. So, do we go... Yeah, we can't jump over there yet, because the, ha ha the hatch thing isn't there, so we'd, have, we'd get on fire, so we need to go this way first. Um, uh, I'm doing alright, just had a slow day at home, but I have found a few job vacancies that I have to get. Oh, good luck with it, JP. It is hard. Like, like I've applied for maybe a dozen jobs, you know, over the past few couple of weeks, and I've only heard back from one that wants to hire me, but it's been taking dragging its feet, and I just don't know what's going on with it anymore, and it's just really annoying, because it's like, I want to get a new job and get settled in in a new place but yeah it's not happened yet so I might have to chase them up again but I'll we'll see right and then we climb over here don't we or do we yeah we go all the way to that height over there and swing why are things never easy <laughs> exactly that is very very true Anastasia um, oh, uh, I, oh, I did tell you, didn't I, on, was it on Anx, Uncle Mistress stream, that um, I'd been playing around with that program you sent me? I really like it, actually. I was, like, getting all excited about all the different brushes and stuff, but I need to really, like, have a good day with it, I think. Um, oh, I thought there was a guy. Um, yeah, I, I didn't, I, like, I sort of just played with it for a bit, and... I mean, all the different brushes are just so good. It does remind me a bit of Photoshop, actually, because I have used that a lot before in the past, but not for years. And the one I use, Paint, doesn't really have that sort of thing. Um, but yeah, I was like, I was doing a, I was just going over a sketch I made, and I was like, there was like a brush that kind of simulates kind of fibres, like hair. So I was like doing the hair, and it's just like, I was so excited. So, <laughs> But I'll definitely be playing with it again. Uh, hopefully I'll do some tomorrow, maybe, or just this week. And maybe I can stream it stream it as well, so that'd be cool. 
Um, it's more annoying when the employee uh, doesn't tell you that you've been rejected for the role. Oh, absolutely. I think that's probably what's happened with a lot of ones I've applied for. I just haven't got it, but they don't tell you. But then the one I have got, like, they're still not getting back to me. And it's just like, you're the one who wanted me to work for you, and now you're not even responding. It's just kind of annoying. But I just have to keep going until something sticks, I suppose. Yes, you did. Glad you liked it. Yeah, it was, um... It was a lot of fun. I mean, I, obviously I need to figure out all the different things in it first, but... Um... Ooh. Let's see. Oh, that didn't work. See, this is... I've sort of... I've, I have changed over to stream elements, but I haven't really done a lot with it yet. So I will be adding the sounds to that, so then they won't be a cooldown. Yeah, it's nice and loud. <laughs> <laughs> there she is, Miss Sophia. Okay, and that opens this bit in the water, doesn't it? I think. Yeah. Ooh, that was, that was interesting. <laughs> yeah, my day's been alright. Um, it was lovely to see, see my friends. I haven't seen them in a while, and I don't get to see them very often, so... That's really nice. Um, he could get eaten. And, yeah, got some videos done, and... Been playing around with my logo and stuff, so... But, yeah, I'm very excited for my... I think, I'm thinking of doing the 100 followers celebration on Monday, next Monday. Um, and we will, uh, there will be lots of surprises in store, so. So this bit, I never know if you run and jump or you just normal jump. Okay. Oh, hey, Laurie, welcome in, just in time to, to meet this uh, Australian guy. Not interrupting, am I? Not bleeding, are you? Not about to use this place as a dunny. No, and no. Good. <laughs> good. Just don't want to be good, Laurie. Oh, and Croft Rider, hey, how are you doing today, my love? What happened? Woke up just in the jungle with one of those guy. little blokes snacking on my leg, didn't I? A tribesman. It isn't usual for them to eat right off the bone like that. Well, it was dark, and I, I never got the bugger, so I can't be sure. Something spooky is in that jungle. Mm, yep. Our air carrier crashed up in the mountains. Every night some of my men would vanish without trace. Others fled in fear. Then this happened. So I brought the men down to shore for safety. Only for us all to be captured by this greedy mob. Some sort of sacrifice to their god who lives up in the hills. Though it seems I've not been invited to the barbie. Maybe you're the dessert. Ripe flesh can be a bit of a delicacy around here. For real? Listen, how does Lara know that? Here. Do you know how the tribe crosses the swamp down there? Which stones they tread on? Yeah, but, uh, not staying put. With this wound, I'd be like a fill-up station to every diseased bug in the bush. I'd rather be the main course. Oh, hey, Layla, how are you? Hey, if you see any of my men alive in there, direct them to the North Shore, will you? Away from here. Of course. I always feel really bad for that guy. I also noticed that he's got lots of w more wounds on him, actually. Like, his eyes bleeding and stuff. It's really horrible. Aww. I like to think that she tells the other guys where he is and they rescue him. So. Okay. <laughs> yeah, how welcome in. Uh, we had Laurie, Croftrider and Layla. Hello. Hope you're all doing well. Happy Tuesday, I suppose. Tuesdays never really that interesting, are they? But... Um, yeah, we are continuing with TR3. We just finished Coastal Village, and now we are on the crash site. And I've got to try and cross the swamp. I can never remember the way to do it. Uh, just Bob's acting like a douche, so dealing with that. Oh, no. Damn it, Bob's. Be good for your mum and your dad. Aw. Uh... I literally just got out of work and jumped here straight away. Oh, well, it's lovely to see you later. Right, let's check the map. Oh, no, it's not the map. Uh, okay. Is it that one or that one, do you think? 
Let's save it and find out. Um, I never managed to keep the other other men alive. Either dinosaurs ate them, or either the big gun at the end bomb them. <laughs> yeah, you was there for standing in the way. Yeah, sometimes I just I don't know. I feel like they they um aren't that resilient. Is it that one or is it that one? I don't know. I can never tell. <laughs> she says a good for me as Bubs is that nursing most of the day. Oh well that's that's a plus, I suppose. <laughs> oh bless him. Eek. Yay. Okay. I think I know where we're going. I think it's that one. That's deadly. Um, stepping stones. <clears throat> uh, Alright, thanks for slowed at home. God, I miss slow days, yeah. Uh, did you manage to get four out of three secrets? Yes, we did, actually. We actually got that um, the last time I played TR3, and we ended, like, just before uh, you climb up the, the ladder to get to the upper bit. So, yeah, we got all of them, so that's interesting. I don't know if that's the only level that has four out of three, because I thought there were more, but apparently this the crash, the, what is it, Coastal Village is the only one, which is strange, but um, I know it's because obviously some of the levels have like multiple routes, don't they? So I guess that's why they added an extra secret here and there, just in case you can't go back, but I don't know. Here we go. Yeah, it's the only one. Oh, okay, cool. Thank you. Yay. MP3. Or is it MP5 clips? Yeah. Have we actually even got that weapon? Oh, not the rocket launcher, love. Yeah, there we go. So it's kind of hard to kind of get back this way. I'll save just in case. See, they put dinosaurs in the loading screen. They probably should have left them out to make it more of a surprise. But oh well. So that was the first secret. I've got to remember where the other two are. Hmm. I think there's one near the end. You have to shoot the wall down, and then and one somewhere else. But my brain. Oh, I think it's in the trees actually. But we'll see. A few weeks ago, I saw on Twitter that you can actually distract the T-Rex by throwing a flare. I was amazed by the tech. Oh my gosh! Yeah, I remember that. Do you know what? We're gonna try that tonight. We'll try it and see if it actually works. Or if we'll get eaten. I mean, it worked for Jeff Goldblum, so it should work for Lara. But then Lara has got a lot more weaponry than him, so she's probably going to be fine. <laughs> oh dear. Yeah, they. I think they take more damage in this game than they did in the first one. It seems like they're quite bullet spongy. And this is just me. You need to try it. Yeah, I definitely will. <laughs> oh, hey, Storm. How are you? Welcome in. Happy Tuesday. We are on the coastal... No, what's it? Crash site today. Trying not to get eaten by dinosaurs. Come out, come out, wherever you are. Hmm. See, there's this bit where you like crawl all the way around there, which I've never actually done, but I don't know what the point of it is. Is that how you're supposed to get on top of the plane? I've never really got what that was for. Maybe we'll try it later. I tried that the other day and was in awe. Apparently it doesn't immediately go after you if you don't move either. Oh wow. So they like totally were like, we're going to emulate Jurassic Park so hard. You need two keys first. Yeah, I just I, I um I've seen people like shimmy around all the the top, and I don't really know why. I've never actually done it that way myself. So oh, shit, there's two. no, don't shoot the man! Don't shoot the man! Eek. I 
can't tell where she's aiming. It's so hard to see that she's aiming. Yay. Yay. Hey, dude. Alright, need to push me. God, how rude. Um, that's so cool, yeah. I got got on top of the plane by climbing the other upside. I think I just, you just jump up the front of it, but I don't know. We'll have a look later anyway, just because, um, like in the India level, there's a whole bit that I'd never really, I would never really go on, and I decided to try it out, and it just leads to a sort of interesting path. I think that's what I like so much about 3, is that there's, there is a lot of hidden stuff that you can completely miss. And it's just so cool that there's like so much depth to it, even for someone like myself who's played it over and over and I've never noticed those things, so yeah. Bubs is living the dine is living the dino's law, yeah. Yay, here's a secret. Uh that is to get inside the sub. Oh, okay. Um inside, but there's a trick that is hard. That is props what you're seeing. It's harder and then unless you know how to skip it. Oh okay. Well, we'll ha we'll have a play, won't we? Do these these guys? They do attack you, don't they? I think. I can't remember. I'm sure in the first section they don't, but maybe they do. That's kind of like I like to avoid killing these little things. Hello. Oh shit! Yeah, you're gonna kill me. Okay, fuck you. I mean, you'd think they'd be fri frightened of her. She's much bigger than them. I don't know. They do, hungry little boys, yeah. <laughs> I mean, wh which Jurassic Park is it? Is it the second one when they eat, like, someone? They, like, eat a man. That's just pretty horrible. And then they also... I think they also attack a little girl, don't they? But she survives, which is even worse. Oh, ready? Okay, we're going to try the flare trick. Okay, let me save, just in case it all goes wrong. Right, where does it come from? Is it? Ah. it Yeah, it sort of goes towards it, doesn't it? Interesting. Eek. Oh shit. <laughs> no. That was, it sort of did it. Let's try again. Sort of is, but then it runs away. Die. Oh, that missed completely. How many rockets does it take? Oh, this game? Wow, really? Okay, it just took about twenty rockets to the face, and it's still not there. Just die! Goodness me, that took forever. <laughs> uh, the second one, yeah, that's uh, with the comp piece, isn't it? Yeah. They eat one in all movies. Oh, lovely. <laughs> God, that T-Rex really was resilient. It sort of got distracted by the flares, but not really, didn't it? So... It didn't, although I was standing still and it didn't get me, so maybe it it does work. I don't think there is another T-Rex though, is there, in this level? So we can't experiment. Oh well. Sadly, that's the last T-Rex we will see until Tomb Raider... Actually, I don't know when. Do we next see them? I oh, know, wrong weapon. I don't know when we even... Ne they don't appear again, do they? Till, like... Is it anniversary? Yeah. It's a shame. 
I don't know why. I guess dinosaurs weren't realistic enough. TX is an anniversary. Yeah, I think there's also one in Guardian of Light, isn't there? That's more like a sort of fantasy one because it's sort of red and and uh, spiky. Oh no, the guy died. R.I.P. Dude. I mean, really, their team isn't very well prepared. I mean, I suppose they weren't expecting to find dinosaurs. But also, what were they even doing here? It's not really explained, is it, why they're here? <sighs> F for the T-Rex, yeah. <laughs> okay, so, what did we actually get? Hmm. We got a key, didn't we? Yes, yeah, so one of the keys we need to get into the... the, um plane isn't it so let us save again and continue onwards and then this is this area do you even need to go in this one i don't remember if you actually need to do it but we'll have a look whoops um oh oh i was gonna say can't open it. see i don't think these guys attack you initially oh maybe i tell a lie I thought they ate these guys. No, we're not going to shotgun them, it's a big stream. Just die. There we go. Hmm. Yeah, I guess, I don't know why there are even dinosaurs here anyway. Is it, do you think there's something to do with the artifacts, perhaps? I don't know. I guess that's, you can just explain it as, oh, it's the artifact that did it. <laughs> um, very tempted to press dramatic reading button right now. I can't think of the perfect kink song, though, for God's sake, JB. I'm sure something will come to you. Um, oh, hey, Dan, how are you? Welcome in. Yeah, we're continuing with TR3 today. I know this is your favourite, um, favourite Lara outfit, so enjoy. Yeah, so I don't think you even need to go in that room. I don't know what it even does. I would help, guys, but I don't want to accidentally shoot you. So I'm, not, I'm just going to run. Bye-bye. Au revoir. Oh, shit. Oh, what? He already died? Wow. Uh, you're too late to save your fallen brother. I'm so sorry. And there's randomly one up in the trees as well, isn't there? Which is curious. How did he get up there? Up we go. Dudes, no! Don't shoot them. <laughs> First time playing this accident, you kill those guys. I mean, it's so easy to do, isn't it? Like you're trying to aim at the raptor, and then the raptor like goes out of range, so she um, she aims at them and shoots them instead. And you're like, no! Oh shit! Uh, oh fuck! Oh, I thought you could jump on that bit. Oh, well. The tree raptor caught me off guard. How did he get up there? Yeah, exactly. How? Oh, hey, Jaden. Welcome in. How are you? Happy Tuesday. I'm just navigating our way through the South Pacific. Trying not to get eaten by dinosaurs. What else? Yeah, and who strung up that raptor in the tree? Like, what? Oh, Roro, hello! Happy Tuesday, how are you, my love? Welcome in. Just killing some, some raptors. There we go, that's that gone. And we will mock this down, like so. I mean, why? Why did they put string up a raptor like that? How bizarre. 
Uh, uh, good, thanks. How are you listening? I'm good, thank you, Jaden. Yeah, happy to be streaming for you lovely people. Uh, I've just had a nice day. I um, saw some friends this morning and I've been sort of doing some video work and designing a new logo, which hopefully I get ready for my 100 followers stream at some point. So, yeah, it's been okay. Um, uh, I'm good just drawing. How are you? Yeah, I'm good. Thanks, Roro. What are you drawing? Anything nice? Uh, some more Tomb Raider tattoos. I really love them that you did. Right. I think we can go in the water now, can't we? Because the piranhas are occupied. Oh my god, what if she, di if she died on that, that bridge? I wonder if that's possible. Right, there we go. And there's some more jokers in here, aren't there? So let's just save it again. Oh, save JP. Yeah, I'm going to. Thank you for the redeem. Uh, I'm good just... Oh, I read that. Uh, very bizarre Christmas decoration indeed, yeah. Commission work. Oh, lovely. Well, good luck with it. Sacrificed him for Godzilla, yeah. Well, it's more likely King Kong, isn't it? Oh, shit. No. Raptors. See, they're not distracted, are they, by the the lights, sadly. Or are they? They've kind of gone a bit placid. That's weird. How long will it take them to die? With a pistol. Bugger off. Thank you. So I never noticed that that gate shut before, but then I suppose that's why there's like two levers. So one of them will open it and let the other raptor in. And then the other one is how you get up, is it? I think. When is the stream still no loads, no meds? Um, what, the 100 followers stream, Jaden? Uh, it will be, I'm thinking, probably Monday. I'll let everyone know beforehand. Uh, um, let me just kill these things and I'll tell them about it. Just die! Freaking hell, they literally are bulletproof. See, damn it. There's like three of them, Jesus. Uh, here we go. Yeah, bitch. That's one way to deal with it. Now this other one's gonna get me. Thank you, goodness me. Uh, I'll call, we'll try my best to be there. Oh, well, it'll be lovely to see everyone. I'm, I've got some interesting things to, to oh shit, show off to everyone when I do it. So it'll be, it'll hope to be a lovely evening. Oh, just die. Oh, God damn it, why are they so resistant? Where's this other lever? Right, here we go. So many raptors I know, so many. Too many. But now they will be really, really extinct after I kill them all. Yay. <laughs> okay, thought of a song. When I press the dramatic redeem, who knows? Oh, God's sake. As long as it's not, like, offensive, it should be okay, but... Ooh. Interesting music. And the one gets up here. How the hell did you get up here, bitch? Well, fuck you. You can stay there. I'm going. I'm out of here. Uh, been busy all day. Was moving all my stuff into my new apartment. Oh, really? How's that been going? Hope you're all settled in now. That's cool. Um. Right. I think we have all the things we need to get into the 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 thingy now, isn't it? Yeah. See, there's three out of three secrets here. 
But I'm sure there's another one up there, and it's just a little extra area, but... Hmm. Interesting. Uh, nothing offensive, we have standards, yeah. <laughs> of course we do. Uh, should be finished by 11. Oh, that's good. Um, I'm having PTSD of trying to play this a few months ago on PlayStation with just the save crystals. Oh, God, tell me about it. See, the next level, Mad Madubu Gorge, is probably my least favourite in this game. Everyone, like, hates on London, but that one, trying to do that with no save crystals is a real pain in the ass. And um, I just remember there's lots of busy work in it that is just not fun. So, yeah, we can swing over to that. But uh, I've never really got this bit. Oh, can we not? Oh, maybe not then. I'm sure we could climb that bit. Am I mistaken? Oops. There's only one extra secret in the level four. Oh, okay. For some reason I thought there's there was another one. Oh, whoops, um, come on, Lara. Unless we just jump to that bit. It looks like you can climb it, doesn't it? How weird. A Dubu Gorge makes London segment look like the city of Kabamba, yeah. <laughs> can we just jump over there, maybe? Let's see if we can try it. Crash side. Oh, not quite. Hmm. Jump forward, oh. What, jump forward and grab, perhaps? Key to save crystals is to rush them for when you need them, yeah. <laughs> but sometimes you need multiple, because these levels are very unforgiving, aren't they? Yay, there we go. Do we jump here? Oh, there we go. Yeah, this is this weird section. We'll see what ha where, where it goes. Let's see if I can... See, the luxury of the PC Tomb Raiders is that you can save whenever you like. And it is an absolute... lifesaver. <laughs> I know, it's the dreaded canoe level next. Yep. That's the thing, like, people bitch about London, but honestly, the canoe... That could go in the bin. That's just horrendous. Because I always used to climb up here and be like, what's the point of it? But there is an actual point, isn't there? I can't see where I'm going. Yeah. We... And then we... Don't we slide down and, and shimmy round, I think? From what I've seen. Uh, no, we don't. Um, one of my fave puzzles. Oh, what what puzzle? Uh, storm. This is even right. Am I going the right way? I would never have completed TR three with the save crystals. Oh my goodness! I mean, it's it's an absolute, yeah, chore, so to speak. Is it over here? Maybe. No. So I think you're supposed to get on that ledge. But how do you get down there? Or am I just being dumb? Let's try loading again. Coming up. Okay. Because you could just go straight to the the um, plane, couldn't you? Where do I go? <laughs> yes, London over uh, Madubu Court any day, yeah. <laughs> oh, I, I don't know what I'm doing. The jump is too far. Oh, okay. I'm sure I've seen something like that, and there's a whole a whole other area, but I can't think remember how to do it. <laughs> I had to play play things on tap. Yeah, 
Oh, bug it. No. Hmm. You are close. Okay. Because we can't, like, climb anything, can we? I'm sure you, like, you have, like, you sort of shimmy around the edge. But I can't really tell what I'm doing. Eek. No, not quite. But then there's, the, I've never like played the level this way. I used to just jump on the plane and like do it that like that, and it was all done. So I'm not pretty sure why this whole section is even here. Nope, nothing up here. Nope. You have the right idea. Oh, okay. But do I? Because we can't shimmy that way. Yeah, see, we're just gonna fall. What's that ledge there? Isn't that where we came from, though? Or is that the section we need to go to? How the fuck do we actually get there? I think you climbed down a ladder, even though it doesn't look like it. Yeah, I don't think she's grabbing anything. See, oh. Hmm. <laughs> How bizarre. There is a trick to it that I don't know. You aren't meant to be able to do that. Oh. Is there another way to it? But then what's the whole point of this climbing up bit? There must be a purpose to it. How strange. Nope. Ouch, my head. <laughs> Not quite. Oh no, we didn't come from that bit. We came from up here, didn't we? Ah. So that is a little extra bit, but can we actually get there? Um, no, just jumping onto the sub from the bottom. You are in the right place up there. Oh, really? Well, how the F do you do it? So bizarre. It can't be like that obscure, because how else would it, how would anyone ever figure out how to do it? I say that, but then it is too raider, so what do we expect? Go to like a running flip jump and like slide back maybe? No, no. <laughs> yeah, like how the hell do you even get up there? Um I think there is a bit where the wall texture blue grey rock to the jump to to the right of the where you were trying to jump down from. Okay. Have a look. So what this bit? Ah. So what we like shimmy, yeah. I mean really, this is it's not just two raid, it's two raid of three, yeah. Gosh. And this is, is this apparently the right way to do it? Because I always just jump on top of the plane. <laughs> but then you fall through the planes, I suppose, because maybe that you're supposed to get up there a legit way, but... I mean, really, how would anyone figure that out? Hey, well, here we go. We actually figured out how to do it. <laughs> It took me ages and I looked up. Oh no, uh, I got so angry at this, oh, I can imagine. Right, I think we're on the right track. Ooh, nice, ominous music. Oh, she won't go that way, fucker. I had to look it up also, I think that's why I remember it as if Save Crystal Situation didn't make the game hard enough, oh well, I know. Yeah, PS3 users were 
PS3. PS1 users were pretty screwed with TR3, weren't they? But I suppose it does hone hone your skills because you kind of have no choice but to replay sections over and over and over. All right, where are we going? So there's a thingy there. Ouch. Have we got to go up there, I guess? Yeah. Um, I climbed on the plane first and went into the cave the other way. Probably not the correct way, but... <laughs> yeah. I literally, I'd never really played it this way. I always play, go, just climb through the... Uh, just jump on top of the plane. Um, this gave this game gave me PTSD gangrene and gout. Oh no! See, I do love three. It's my favourite, but it is pretty bullshit sometimes. <laughs> uh, and at least on PC, you can save as many times as you like, so you, you can get through it without going mad. Yeah, uh, you do have the two keys, right? Yeah, we've got. Commander Bishops and Lieutenant Tuckerman. Rest in peace, dudes. Right now, where are we going? Because I think we need to raise that bit, don't we? Oh, this is so bizarre. Oh, shit. Okay, she just decided not to hold on. What a silly madam. Okay. He does it, monkey swing. Now she has got, yeah, and two broken legs. <laughs> uh, Rippy, Pippy, Commander Bishop, and Lieutenant Tuckerman, yeah. I wonder if they were like, maybe they were, that uh, plane was hired by Willard or something to find the other artifact, but then why didn't he tell Lara? Oh, they hadn't done it right. But how do we actually do them? Not like that. Bugger. So there's a thingy over there, but we can't get to that because there's... Oh, that's where we need to go, isn't it? Oh, see? Just have a look around, kids. Ugh, really? I hope it's not. Oh, that shut that one though. Ah, oh, but ah, oh, I see that's climbable. There we go. <sighs> what exactly was Willard's plan? I don't even know, to be honest. But obviously, when we we well, we'll see him later, won't we? And he's like super excited about evolution, but it's not really explained what he wants to do. I don't can't imagine he unless he really wanted to become a giant uh, mutant spider, you know. Maybe that was his dream all along. You know, you do you, Willard. <laughs> Just winging it. Yeah, exactly. He was like, well, I mean, I must do something with these thingies. Oh shit! Oh bugger! I f should not have dropped down. I thought he could. That was a ledge. Whoopsie. Come and make yourself at home, it throws tomato soup. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I think maybe he he just gone a bit mad. But then what was his excuse? He was sick of being stuck in Antarctica all the time. And freezing his butt off. Oh, excuse me. Ah, indeed. Right, here we go. And don't drop down like an idiot. <sighs> yeah, I hope everyone's had a good uh, Tuesday today. We are having a bit of a heat wave in the UK at the minute. It's not as bad as it was, luckily. Oh, shit. <laughs> See, this is what I get for not being careful. Damn it. Third time's the charm, I suppose. <sighs> right, here we go. Yeah, I think it's it's not as going to be as hot as it was, but it's still going to be quite warm, I think. So great. <clears throat> <sighs> soup was hella frozen. Yeah, he was. It was like a tomato soup, like ice cream, basically, wasn't it? So he probably loved it. 
To be fair, I know a four-year-old who wants to be a dinosaur when he grows up, so giant mutant spider isn't so unrealistic. Oh, Yeah, I suppose so. I suppose if you were like a giant dinosaur, you could, could like, you know, archaeologists or whatever, not archaeologists, what is it, paleontologists, you could like pay, they could pay you to like come and visit you and study you, so that'd be quite a good way to earn a living. But as a giant mutant spider, I don't think anyone really wants that, do they? So, oh, whoops, pull the lever. There we go. Twenty or twenty or twenty or twenty three degrees means nothing to me. I can still wear a jacket. Yeah. Well, it's going to get up to like I think the early, uh, like low thirties from what I've read. So that will be interesting. But honestly, after that heat wave, I think we'll probably be okay because that was just yeah, not fun. <laughs> Not the low 30s again, yeah. I mean, that heat wave, I think, was almost 40, wasn't it? So it probably won't be as bad, but... Oh, no, I need to do that again, don't I, bugger? Hang on, let me reload. Well, it became a house spider, good for him. Yeah, good, well, sort of a house spider. He also had his human face, which I don't know if it's even more disturbing than an actual spider. There we go. But like, if he kills, it, like, if he killed Lara, then what? Like, what does he do? Will he just go out into the world? Like, oh, look at me, I'm a big Spider-Man. And I suppose he can't die though if all the artifacts are in the the cavern. But then, what what would you just do? Just walk around scaring people for the rest of your life? It's kind of like that thing with Resident Evil, though, isn't it? Like when they mutate into a giant like blob monster. It's like, if they actually killed the hero, what would they then do? They'd just be a big blob. And they'd have to, like, like you know, live out their their days as a big blob. What? Why is that one down? Did I do something wrong again? Oh, mother of pearl. Ooh, what's this? Damn it. So how do we get the other one to go up? I saw a thing down there, actually. Let's have a look. Right, so... That's... Only raised that one. So that means we can get round that side. There must be another lever. Um... And a left over human arm! Oh, oh no! <laughs> yeah, he has got... He's got, like, his face and it... Yeah. No, he has two faces, doesn't he? He has the one at the front, and then he has like his other on the side of him, which is kind of ick. How do we get that other... It's down there, isn't it? Hmm. But we can't even get in here, because it's shut off. Okay. I am Confusion. We can climb up there, though. Unless that's the way we go first, maybe? Uh, live on ceiling, make a web, then die because he made the web in a stupid place, like every spider. <laughs> okay, I'm seriously stuck, because I haven't opened all these things. Hmm... Sorry, Lara, I'm just not sure what to do. So that lever we pulled over there rose one of the gates we need to swing across, didn't it? So where the hell's the other one that we need? And if it's shut behind those gates, how do we open those gates? Hmm. Interesting. I, uh, I hate arachnids, yeah, I don't think many people like them. And they are useful creatures, but they are kind of not nice. Okay, I'm so stuck. Let's have a look around first. So we know that that 
just as those ones. Is there anything over here? That slide just leads us to a pit, which is not what we want. Uh, got Lara entangled in his web of lies and deceit yet. Only arachnids I can think I can tolerate would be crabs, lol. <laughs> well, crabs are nice. Well, seaside crabs. <laughs> Not the other kind. <laughs> um, oh, what the hell do we do? How do we open those down there? That did put, that did lift that up, didn't it? Or am I tripping? Let me try and reload it and see what happens. If I even got a save there. Yeah. So that's all that that does. So there must be another lever to open those two gates. But how does it happen? And then there's one there as well. Ah, oh, what the shit? Unless we swing round, maybe? <sighs> Please forgive my incompetence. I haven't played this section often, if at all. So, I don't know what I'm doing. I'm back! Oh hey, hey welcome back Layla, hope you're good. Just trying to navigate this level. Right. Maybe we swing round to the other bit. I don't know if I want to flare there because then she won't hold on. It's not Tomb Raid if you don't get stuck by a section for ages. <laughs> yeah, how was work today, Layla? I hope it was okay. No, don't go too far, Chuffle. So I can't see if I can like, go down there or not. Oh, hydrate and save, I will in a second. I've just got to swing from the monkey bars. Is there a bit there, maybe? Oh, it's so annoying because you can't look down. Oh. Maybe it's something to do with this bit, because then you can actually go here, but... Shit. Oh, that, that door is open. So maybe we do... Go all the way around there. How bizarre. Anyway, let me load and I will hydrate. There we go. And I will also save, even though I'm already saved in this bit. But I'll do it for you, Layla. <laughs> Lara teams up with Murdoch and BA Baccarat. <laughs> Yeah, that'd be. I wonder what 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 um, crossovers would you like to see with Tomb Raider? There's quite a few good ones, isn't there? I mean, obviously, the obvious one is like Uncharted or Indiana Jones, I guess. But you could, she could, uh, you know, you could do quite a lot of different series like crossovers, couldn't you? Uh, it wasn't too bad, apart from managers getting stressed because. Uh, the country, county store managers are coming to our store for meetings and everything has to be perfect. Oh, yeah. Yeah. They always get on edge, don't they, when the higher-ups come. Kingdom Hearts, yeah. See, La... <laughs> I don't know if she'd fit, fit well with that. She might be a bit too bloodthirsty. So, what's the best way to drop down? Is it... If I turn around, perhaps? Now that isn't open. What the fuck? How do you do it? Oh, it is open. Okay, I don't know why it opened, but it just did. Yay. Goodness gracious me. Right, save it. Minecraft, it's Winnie the Pooh. 
Knight Rider? Tomb Raider X Barbie Explorer. <laughs> oh god. Um. Did they ever do a Lara Croft Barbie? I bet they did. Probably should have done a Lara Croft Action Man. That would have been better. Action Woman. Tearly Masters of the Universe. Quest for the Power Sword. Yeah. Here we go. Oh. Although, what do we do? We can't reach that, can we, from here? I'm going to try this, but we will get murdered. Yeah. No. See, that did not work. <sighs> I'm not sure what to do. Guess she won't grab it, will she? Hmm. Tomb Raider X Jaws. I mean... <laughs> It wouldn't be a very long movie because Lara would just shoot it. Action was long gone when TR came along, lol. While well, the original one was, yeah. Uh, how the f, f do we get up there? Could we jump over there maybe? And Yeah, maybe. We just, I don't know if that's how you actually do it, but I can't think of another way to get around there. Okay, there's that. Actually, Lara would punch the shark. Oh, she absolutely would. Um, you're probably thinking of the Hashbro version. Oh, I honestly don't know. I had an action man when I was a kid, but it was probably an old one. Tomb Raider X Predator. Oh, well. Yeah, I mean, she'd be real good in like a... You know, like a alien movie, wouldn't she? She'd kick their asses. No, don't punch the shark. Yeah, Layla loves sharks, guys. We don't have can't have any shark slander. Do you like those movies then, Layla? When like Jaws and like Deep Blue Sea and all that, because they make the sharks into. Uh, killing machines, don't they? Alright, here we go. I know, not the second film. Oh yeah, I know you're not a fan of Cradle of Life, Dan. <laughs> I honestly don't mind it. I actually um, think it's a laugh, but... I actually got the novelizations for the first and second film. They're actually quite good. I definitely recommend them if you can find them. Oh shit, what am I doing? Being an idiot. And load. Yeah, see that was the really, really long way around. Which... I'm sure you can just jump. In fact, why don't we try it? I'm sure you just jump up like one of these ledges and you can get up there. Maybe that's not the way you're supposed to do it. That's the way I've always done it. Yeah, so you slide down, but then I'm sure there's a bit where you can like... No, it's not. What? Oh, but shooting the shark's okay. <laughs> oh, I see. Yeah, it, it's a good job you didn't see Tomb Raider 2, um, Layla. Oh no, you were watching it, um, Ash play it yesterday, weren't you? Although, it's hard to kill the sharks with the harpoon gun. See, look, you can get on the on the top of it here, like that. Is that not how you're supposed to do it? Or are you supposed to go all, all that other way, but that's the right, uh, chore. Oh, fuck off. There we go. The start of it's okay, but beyond that, it's pure balls. <laughs> I actually really like the artifacts in that, the um, the orb and the Pandora's box and all that. I just think it's so cool. I always liked when Tomb Raider did that, like with a sort of like 
real world myths and legends and like had the Tomb Raider version of it. I think that's a really uh, or, like cool idea. Now, obviously, we had Atlantis and we've got like you know Egyptian gods and things and all that sort of stuff. I just really like it. That's why we left Tomb Raider. Okay, have I done it wrong? I think I need to do another bit, don't I? At the top. I oh, know it's a button. No sharky boys will be killed. <laughs> Are you a fan of like shot actual shark films then, Layla? When the sharks are like killers. I mean, Jaws is pretty much a, a classic horror film, isn't it? But um, yeah, not if you're a fan of of. Uh... Yeah, I don't know if you should shoot these guys, but they just get in the way. Oh, I blew it up without blowing him up. Great. Mind out for the rockets. Oh no, he died. Oh well. Come on, perish. How many of them are there? I just blown up. About a hundred. Still coming, Jesus. <laughs> Is that it? Goodness me. <sighs> anyway. Um I'll just catch up a chat. I watch them because I love seeing the sharkies, but they scary sometimes. <laughs> yeah, there's one Blake Lively in that scary AF. Oh, I've, I've I haven't watched that one. That does look good though. Um, also, I just messaged someone about getting two new emotes. Oh, lovely! Uh, having to do this section without using a safe crystal midway was stressful. <laughs> yeah, it's not too bad, I suppose. This bit, but right. So I shot that bit up there, which apparently isn't a secret, but I always thought it was, but. I don't know. Let's have a look. Oh, I've just saved for you, Layla. Thank you for that, Redeem. Oh, Wolfie, hello. How are you? How are to you too, sir? Hope you're good. Yeah, we just uh, s slaughtered a bunch of raptors. Oh, no, so this isn't a secret. It's just an extra bit. Oh, I don't know why I always thought that was a secret. Oh, well. Right, here we go. Yay. Yay, Raptor Barbecue, yum yum yum. <laughs> this cutscene is quite interesting because we get a little bit of backstory, don't we, about the, the artifacts and the history of it. Best of norms. <laughs> Hello. Is well for you, me fast in this day. You make plenty good flesh pot. You forget. I might be quite hungry myself. Famished, actually. Ugh. Says she needs a burger or something. Why did your ancestors flee from Antarctica so suddenly? Oh. Coma, coma. Bad place. Plenty flesh. But for the price of evil. Mutilation. I wonder what raptor tastes like. And if anyone says leader. chicken. <laughs> okay. were born I mean, it's probably not place. that far off. They are, Terrible like, storms. both birds. Men afraid. Run! Set curse of Maoki on the land. No one good enough. But you still worship it? White fella later come here with magic Kuma Kuma stone. In a day, we celebrate the death <laughs> of him, the feast of smile. One of Darwin's sailors, poor fool. Where's the stone now? <laughs> Mm. 
He lucky fella that kill you. A plenty merry like you. I'll be sure to point that out to him. <laughs> <laughs> Yay. And now we're on this... This level. Uh, like a crocodile, or perhaps duck, maybe? Who knows? I mean, I don't know if I'll ever get the chance to eat a raptor. But, um... We haven't had the Uzis yet. I'm pr I probably did have them, but... Uh, now I've got to d deal with these lizard things. Uh, or perhaps duck. Oh, I do like duck, actually. I haven't had it for a long time, but it's nice. So these things, apparently... What, where was it? Does anyone know who Ink Ribbon is? He does like Art Resident Evil videos, but he also did a few Tomb Raider ones. And I'm sure he said these things are called Dragonettes, and they're all female, and they're also based off the Hunters from Resident Evil. And it's like, it's all to do with the myth of, um, of, um, Puna, who's like an actual figure in, what is it? In like some sort of mythology, I can't remember the details now, but I'm sure there's some sort of reference there. I have to look it up again, but um, <sighs> quack. Not sure I've had duck to be honest. Yeah, I know him. Oh yeah, he does really good stuff, doesn't he? He's mainly Resident Evil stuff, but um, he does do a few Tomb Raider things as well. Uh, I watched Incredible stuff. He did a clap with Steve. At yeah, I remember that, wasn't it? All the the um, the Game Boy versions of Tomb Raider, or the portable versions, perhaps. I actually used to have um, Legend. I think it was on PSP. It was it was okay, but the game was too much for it, and this is just because my PSP was knackered. Um, it yeah, it didn't work as brilliantly as it could have, so I I just stuck with my PS2 version. <laughs> oh, let me just read what Real Wolf is put. Dragonets are enemies that appear in Tomb Raider Three: Dungeons and Craft. Their origins are unclear, but they may have being created by Puna, who uses the Aura Dagger Meteorite artifact to summon them to his aid. The Aura Dagger is also fashioned at the shape of a lizard. Yeah, it's possible that he made them. But I think there's like, you have to look up the video by Ink Ribbon. Um, is it, I'm sure there's like a whole thing with like the actual, is it maybe Polynesian myth of, of a guy called Puna, who was like a god or something. But I don't know. Don't quote me on it because I'm not sure, but... Oh, I somehow missed that. Silly me. Uh, there was a legend on GBA. Lo yeah, I, I think I've seen it. Or was it DS? Something like that, wasn't it? And it's like basically 2D side scroller version of Tomb Raider. It doesn't even look that bad, to be honest. So. <laughs> okay, so. The lovely rapids. Oh shit, hey. Hey, girl. Got me, how rude. Uh, imagine having all that power and you create reptile legs to satisfy your scaly fetish. <laughs> exactly. Well, each to each their own, I suppose. I had a uh, legend on PSP too. I love playing it in the car. It felt so futuristic back then, yeah. I still have my PSP somewhere, actually. I love it. Oh, bugger. Oh. That was interesting. Oh no, I didn't save it. Oh, sorry right then. Um, the Puna Matata, yeah. What a wonderful king and lizard creator. Uh, wouldn't want to play either of them. Oh, never played Legend of Jubilee, but. Yes, version was definitely it. Again, it was definitely a game. Yeah, <laughs> definitely a thing that happened. <laughs> yeah, it's weird how some games like get ported to everything. As, well, I guess that like, Legend weirdly was like almost like the RE4 of Tomb Raiders with the amount of ports it's got. It's got so many, hasn't it? Right. The PSP is basically a portable PS2, yeah. You have your PSP. I got rid of mine when I was young and I regret it. Oh, 
Yeah, I've had it for God knows how many years now. I mean, it's so much fun. No. Ouch. Don't hurt me, love. There we go. To eBay. <laughs> God knows how much they are now. That's the thing, like, with games like that, though. Like, how... Um, because you can't play PSP games on modern consoles, can you? Do they even... What is it called? Oh, I tried again. Is it a PS Vita? That's the newer one. But is there a newer one than that? Because that's probably quite old now as well. So, is it just, like, obsolete now? Which is kind of sad. I think I... Because I, I downloaded all the Tomb Raiders on my PS3 from the store, and then I put them all on my... Yeah, uh, PSP, which is cool. Okay, so... Oh, this bit. I'm trying to remember where all the secrets are as well in this one. I just don't remember. There's one in, like, behind a waterfall, isn't there? There's one in, like, a hut. And there's another one somewhere else, but I can't remember. I'll be cold and dead before I recognise GP Energy. <laughs> oh no, I'm going to have to look it up after this. Um... I love classics ported to on the Nintendo Switch. Yeah. Have they ever actually put Tomb Raider on them? Um, like a Nintendo console? Was was Legend on GameCube? Or any of them on GameCube? Maybe, maybe not. Ooh, closely, does it? Eek. Why said the end of the uh, stories were sh the shit on PSV, yeah. I love, I mean, I'm a huge Tekken fan, so I had Tekken 5. I think Tekken 5 Dark Resurrection, that's the reason I got a PSP and I actually played the hell out of that. Oh, Gunsy, hello! Welcome in, how are you, my dude? Happy Tuesday. We're trying not to murder Lara. Can we go that way as well? I'm trying to remember what to do. I think this might be a secret, actually. Or am I mistaken? Let's just save it and we'll reload if we bought up. Um, we we'll just catch up a chat. Not that I'm aware, you can play certain Vita games on TV with PS TV mini console, but that's about it. Yeah. Uh, I must be able to play the PS Vita version of Lego Jurassic World on TV. <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, I have a PS TV and that's how I play Classic TR, but I want PC ports. Yeah, PC ports are the way to go, I would say. Legend of Zelda game on the GameCube. Oh, cool. Yeah, I think they must have ported Legend to like basically everything. Because I suppose it was kind of like the re the first reboot, so they really like wanted to uh, go all out with it. Uh, yeah, just the wee one of them you have to find because you have to one of them you have to find because it's on the way to where you have to go. Oh, okay, I'm very well just playing as Ada in DVD on PC in the public beta. Oh wow, how long is that open for? I'd love to try it. Are you enjoying playing as Ada? Although I did see people were crying earlier because apparently she's not going to have her... <laughs> she's not going to have high heels on in the game. And people were like, no. And people were like, oh, it's not realistic. And then it's like, well, they're being chased by, like, supernatural creatures. So realistic realism is kind of out the window. But, yeah, realism is not a great argument, is it? She has her heels on. Oh, good. That's the most important thing, isn't it? <laughs> See, this way, that's... We can get to that waterfall, can't we? That is a secret, but what's the other way? Is that... Oh. I'm going to have to not save it, because I can't remember the right way. Legend was pretty much on everything. PS2, PSP, GameCube, DS, GBA, Xbox, Xbox 360, PC... Toaster, scientific calculator, yeah. Any, anyone ever played the game of St Toy Story 2? Uh, yes. I actually, the other day, I set up my PS2 for my little brother to play because he wanted to play it because he loves Toy Story. Um, yeah, it's very interesting. Oh no, I don't want to save it, do I? I can't remember where the secrets are. There's one in the hut, one behind a waterfall, and there's one more. 
I think I think we're going the right way, so I'll try not to die for a bit. I had legend in my sun <laughs> yeah. I had legend on my tablet, not my digital tablet, my like ch like chalkboard tablet. Oh no. Hey baby girl. Gross. How, how long does that um that DVD thing go on for guns? I'd quite like to try Ada. Maybe it's only for today though. What about the killer? Do you get to play as Wesker as well? That'd be cool. See this? I don't know where we're going. Let's have a look. Eek. Yeah, this is just a little extra area, isn't it? There's not actually anything here that we can use. It's just a crystal. Uh, I've been playing Toy Story 2 via the PlayStation Plus Classic Catalog. Oh shit. Yeah, I, I got Tekken 2 for myself, like, a while ago on there. Um, because I really wanted to just stream it, but, um, I haven't got a capture card or anything, and I was going to stream straight from the PS4, but it just wasn't very good, so I'll have to do that eventually, because I love Tekken so much, and Tekken 2 was my very first one, so I want to play it for people. Although I remember it being kind of hard. Um... Secrets are very easy to come across in the server. One behind the waterfall, one in the hut, and one on the other side of a river near another waterfall. Okay, so I don't... Because I, I know that you can go left or right at the first set of rapids, but I just couldn't remember... Maybe the other one just lets the canoe out, because there's, like, several canoes, isn't there? Maybe that's it. But it doesn't matter too much. I just quite like to be thorough. Oh, no, we're not going to explode the lizard ladies. Um, I had the t Toy Story game for the Sega Mega Drive. Oh wow! Yeah, my first console was a Super Nintendo, and um, I loved Donkey Kong Country series on that. That was oh, that's just nostalgia for me. But um, I wasn't much older when I got my PlayStation One either, so. Yeah, it's kind of crazy, isn't it, how, like, they don't do that anymore, do they? They don't make, like, video game, video games based off of movies, really, do they? Much, not like that, anyway, they used to do them all the time. I suppose I can say because we can get back, can't we, but, um... Uh, just don't go the shortcut way as you're missing secrets, okay, I, I think I know what I'm doing, but we'll see. Um, the first secret is always very, very close to the second. Okay, thank you. Uh, most recent one I can think of is Car 3 Race to Win. Yeah, but how old is that now? That's like not that recent, is it? Well, Lee, if I, when I do start streaming Donkey Kong Country, will be on the list. Yes! Ah, oh, if I could do it, I totally would. It's more profitable to make TV movies based on games. Yeah, I, I, they don't really seem to do it much anymore, do they, though? Like, I mean, I remember ones that I didn't even, like, I wasn't really even interested in. Like, they did definitely did, like, Spider-Man ones. They did a sh they did loads of Shrek ones, didn't they? Um, there's probably loads more, but, uh, you know, it was a crazy time, wasn't it? The early 2000s, mid-2000s. Okay, there's one down there, isn't there? I know that. Um, why don't you stream it for yourself? Oh, I totally would try. I'm not sure. I think I'd have to get a capture card, wouldn't I? Um, that'd probably be the best way to do it. Because uh, I'd love to also stream from like my PS4 and PS3 as well. There's loads of games like on that that I'd love to share with people. Sorry, it's a baby. Spider-Man 2 game was fantastic, yeah, I mean, I'm not a huge Spider-Man fan, to be honest, but um, I know they did lots of things for that one, didn't they? 
Then Spider-Man 3 game happened, but it had really funny QTE fails. Oh god, bloody QTEs, no thank you. Oh no, we're gonna get set on fire. No thank you. Every Disney Pixar film got its own game, those were the days, yeah. I remember some of them. Oh really? Damn it. Just use emulators on your PC. Yeah, I suppose I could. I've never really tried an emulator. I mean, honestly, like, that's probably going to have to be the way people are going to be able to play games anymore. Oh, really? Shit. Because, um, you know, there's not, like, not every game is on, like, the PS Store or on PC, is it? So, there's going to be a day where basically they're, they're lost. And it's, like, it's sad that we can't get, like, they can't, like, be made digital. So, oh, another dragon thing. No, to get me. Okay, I think we're good. Uh, loved Wally on PS3, yeah. Shit game for a shit film, lol. <laughs> I actually don't think I've seen that one. I've, I remember the first Tobey Maguire one. Uh, what was the second one? I can't remember. Oh, no. Oh, we didn't get that It's cool. classics on my Mac. Oh really? Um, do Is Tomb Raider not available on Mac? Or do you just mean generally older games? Um, yeah, it's a shame, isn't it? Yeah, they really need to sort of work on like archiving that sort of stuff, but I guess it depends on the companies and stuff, which is sad. I remember when they were going to close down the PS the um, PS3 store, weren't they? Because they were like, eh, no one likes old games, and then everyone like went mad at them, and so they kept it. <laughs> I was like, yeah, people play old games all the time. I mean, how many streamers stream classic games? How many people will do like speedruns of classic games? You know, so it's, it's kind of dumb. There's, isn't there a secret here as well? I'm sure there is. We'll have a look. There it is, up the rock wall. Yeah, I know, there's the one in the hut. And I, is there another one nearby? Ooh, don't lag. Don't know why it does that sometimes. Oh no. No. No, 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 no. We're not going to the canoe yet, because I don't want to. Seeing it, it, the rights has to be a big part of it. Oh, okay. Yeah, I suppose so. Oh, here we go. We go down there, don't we? Yeah, it's a shame. I still have, like, a bunch of PS1 games that, that work for me, so... Sadly, they'll probably all deteriorate one day. Here we go. So this is, this is number two. Oh shit, oh, that's close. <laughs> but I accidentally pressed the replay button. Replay button? What, for Twitch? What did you replay? Something interesting. Right, so... I have a feeling there is another one quite close to this. Maybe it's just me remembering it wrong. But we'll see. Yeah, there's a crystal down there, but I think that's when you get in the canoe. I think we have to jump over there, don't we? I don't know. Ooh, shit. I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> Whoopsie. I was about to say, the Finding Nemo game was interesting, to say the least, the Finding Nemo game, well... 
Yeah, crazy times, eh? <laughs> There's a lot of people who work on arcade and games digitally, so they will never achieve last night. That's cool. Yeah, I do think that's important. You know, think about, like, with old movies and stuff. They, they, um... You know, they remaster them and stuff, don't they? And, uh... What, so why not do that with games? Not, obviously not all of them are probably popular enough to do that, but you think they'd there'd be some way of doing it. Uh, I don't know. Oh, Angel Ash, hello, how are you? Happy Tuesday, lovely to see you. We're going through TR3. We're, oh gosh, making our way through the South Pacific. Now we're on the dreaded, dreaded... Medubu Gorge. But we'll see if we can do it without me losing my sanity. Or well, what's left of it. <laughs> but yeah, I hope you're good. Um, why were ne Nemo's eyes deemed red? I don't know. He's a, a devil fish. Oh shit. Oh god, why does it keep lagging like that? It's so strange. Alright, load again. Yeah, Island's music is hard than has any point to. <laughs> I think it's over there, isn't it? Yeah. Is there actually another secret round here? Am I going mad? Oh no. I think it's it when you're in the canoe, isn't it? I think. I don't know. Uh, is this a section with the big ladder? Um, I think there is a bit where we have to climb up a huge wall, isn't there? The last six in the cave after using the kayak. Oh, okay, thanks, JP. Yeah, I think I think I remember where it is, but we'll see. <laughs> I know, where am I going? Is this actually where we go to progress the level? Yeah, it is. It's next week up here, don't we? Because that's where the kayak is. Great. Hope you guys are hyped for the kayak. Uh, I remember they had adverts for those games on the VHS coffee. Oh well, I'm back. Welcome back, Layla. Yeah, um, chat. Don't forget to play around with the sounds, and we've also got commands. Uh, I've also got a Discord if you'd like to join the Discord. I'll probably be posting updates about my hundred followers stream in that, and also on social media. So just kill these crocodiles. Go on. Yes, it just perished. What about the other one? Go on, go away. Yay, okay. <sighs> dreaded, dreaded kayak. Love this outfit. Yeah, this is pretty cool, isn't it? I think Tomb Raider, Tomb Raider 3 really went all out, didn't it, with the different outfits, so... Girl's got to have her clothes, different clothes, when she's off on adventures. Right, here's, oh, here there it is. Here we go. Right, is everyone ready? Young people these days, what's VHS? Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Um, oh, when did you get to 100? Um, I think it was last stream, actually, Wolfie. Uh, was it last stream or maybe the stream before? But yeah, that was really exciting. So I'm going to do a 100 followers stream maybe Monday. And I'm going to do like a, um, a challenge run of TR to gold. No loads, no meds, all secrets, pistols only. <laughs> and every time I die, I'm going... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, shut the shop. Every time I die, I'm going to take a shot. And I'll also have some interesting redeems, I think. And maybe some new challenges and sounds, so... Yeah. Hope you can join. Oh no, do we have to go that way, to the to the right? Oh, I don't know. Let's just see what happens. Still no milkshake. Oh, I, I can get milkshake if you want. Oh no, not this bit. No! Hang on. Oh. 
Row, row, row your boat quickly up the stream. Don't get murdered by the major traps, bitch. There we go. <laughs> Playmates made a cool figure of that. Yeah, I really wish I had some of those figures. I love all the Tomb Raider merch they used to do because they don't really do that much anymore, do they? Apart from those statues, which are they're cool, but they're not exactly like cheapest chips. Oh no, is this the right way? Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh god, dramatic reading. Whistle by Flow Rider. <laughs> okay. Um uh, they made a ton of great TR figures, yeah. You're gonna get Riggedy Rex <laughs> Yeah. Um okay, let me just uh do this. Hang on a sec. Uh, I was in HMV a few years ago and a child looked at a record player and asked, What is that? Yeah, I suppose it's not the common thing, is it nowadays? <laughs> They're not what you would call action figures, okay? So do people do people want me to do the dramatic reading now? Should we try and just get past the rapids or Um No I didn't save it. Do you know what? Let's just do it now because uh, otherwise it'll take me forever. Anyway. Yeah, let's find the lyrics. I don't know if I even know this song. Have I got to whistle it? Because I can't really whistle. <laughs> Is this another room? I bet it is. Come on then, you stupid thing. Oh god. <laughs> just saw a... <laughs> I just saw a... Like, a picture of the video and it just looks very... Saucy. Um... I <laughs> found just catch up a chat. Uh, the song about blowjobs that people can sing in public without looking weird. Oh god. Sorry, my chat's being weird. Just let me see it. Still weird though. No, just talk it with your sexy voice. <laughs> All right, well, whatever you say. Let's see if it comes up right. I love blowjobs. I mean, we thought, yeah. <laughs> okay. Oh, this. I keep getting all these adverts come up. Go away. Oh, wait, I know this song. Yeah, I have heard this one. Okay. <clears throat> Right, settle in kids, this is a dramatic reading of Whistle by Flo Rider. <clears throat> Can you blow my whistle baby? Whistle baby, let me know. Girl, I'm gonna show you how to do it. And we start real slow. You just put your lips together and you come real close. Can you blow my whistle baby? Whistle baby, here we go. Look. I'm betting you like people, and I'm betting you love freak mode, and I'm betting you like girls that have that give love to girls, and stroke your little ego. I bet you I'm guilty, your honour. And, oh, that's just how we live in my genre. Who in the hell done paved the road wider? There's only one flow and one rider. I'm a damn shame. Order more champagne. Pull a damn hamstring. Trying to put it on ya. Bet your lips spin back round the corner. Slow it down, baby. Take it a little longer. Can you blow my whistle, baby? Whistle, baby. Let me know. Girl, I'm going to show you how to do it. And we start real slow. You can just put your lips together. And you come real close. Can you blow my whistle, baby? Whistle, baby. Here we go. Repeat, repeat. It's like everywhere I go, my whistle ready to blow. Shorty don't leave a note. She can get any by the, lo the low. Told me she's not a pro. It's okay, it's under control. Show me soprano, cause girl, you can handle. Baby, we start snagging. You come up in part clothes. Girl, I'm losing wing. My Bugatti, the same road. Show me your perfect bitch. Oh, 
I meant to say pitch. <laughs> Show me your perfect pitch. You got it in my banjo, talented with your lips, like you blew out a candle. So amusing, now you can't make a whistle with the music. Hope you ain't got no issue, you can't do it. Give me the perfect pitch, you never lose it. Can you blow my whistle, baby? Whistle, baby, let me know. Girl, I'm going to show you how to do it, and we start real slow. You just put your lips together, and you come real close. Can you blow my whistle, baby? Whistle, baby. Here we go. Go, girl, you can twerk it. Let me see you whistle while you work it. I'ma lay it back, don't stop it. Cause I love it, how you drop it, drop it, drop it on me. Now, shorty, let that whistle blow, oh, oh, oh. Yeah, baby, let that whistle blow, oh, oh. <laughs> Can you can you blow my whistle, baby? Whistle, baby, let me know. Girl, I'm going to show you how to do it, and we start real slow. You should just put your lips together and come real close. Can you blow my whistle, baby? Whistle, baby. Here we go. There we go. Did you like it? <laughs> For God's sake. These lyrics, man. What the actual frig do they even mean? There's only one flow and one rider. I'm sh I'm a damn shame. Order more champagne. Pull a hamstring. <sighs> oh my goodness! What a load of baloney! <laughs> you picked the perfect time to enter the stream. Hello, how are you? Uh, perfect bitch. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> my mistake. This is like a novel. <laughs> <laughs> Loved every second. Standing ovation. Oh, thank you. Thank you so much. This is what I've thought about all day, to be honest. Smut that mothers can sing in front of their children. I'm all right. <laughs> well, I hope hope you, yeah, you're you not going to run and hide after that. But yeah. Um, well. I hope you enjoyed it. Right. Um, now we are going back to TR3. <laughs> I'm not sure Lara would approve of it, but oh well. Yes, we're now on this dreaded kayak. Oh, that was interesting. <sighs> is there actually whistling in that song? Well, there is, isn't there? Oh, I didn't open the thing. Go out. I'm sure there is. I haven't heard it for years. <laughs> It's funny that how TR3 has the worst and best vehicle. Yeah, what what would you call the, the best vehicle? The quad bike? I mean, that is pretty good, isn't it? It's leagues above the thing in the bike in TR4. But then the kayak, absolutely, is just a load of tripe. So, no. Right. Can you blow my whistle, baby? No, because I'm trying to move this bloody kayak, which is a pain in the neck. Quad bike by far, absolutely. The quad bike is so much fun. <clears throat> They've got to try and do this without perishing. Is it possible to go to the right? Maybe that's just another way you come from, I can't really remember. Right, over here, over here, over here, avoid the things, quick. Such a bastard, how much damage you do. <sighs> then you ought to go that way to stop the the um spikes. Goodness me. <laughs> Thanks, JP. <laughs> yes, I can try to. Without losing my marbles. Eek. Slowly does it. I don't know if you go that way, but... Oh, for fuck's sake. No. Oh, God damn it. Ouch. Ooh, some weird texture glitch there. That's strange. Come on, Lara, row. You can do it. 
We have strong lady. Yay! Goodness me. Best devil. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no. I honestly think this is the my least favourite, actually, compared to, like, the London levels. Like, the London levels, I think it's just because they're quite long and convoluted, especially if you go for the secrets. But this one, it's just the nightmare. Well, it's, it's not... I suppose it's just the kayak, really. The rest of it isn't that bad. But, yeah, the kayak can, can perish. <laughs> I'm sure this level's an absolute bastard for no no limits. Oh my god. No, never ever do that. Do we go there? Or do we go up? Don't we go up a bit? I don't remember. I really like the London levels. Yeah, I like them. They are, like complex I'd say they're probably the most tricky levels I'd say and there's lots of like backtracking and stuff isn't there or oh, if you um want to get all the secrets and such but uh I do like them maybe it's probably just because I'm biased because I like Sophia so <laughs> go on up we go I don't even know if this is where we go but we'll try it Go on, Lara. Apparently the rapids, she can swim up them, or row up them easily. I mean, what? No. Come on, sis. Go on. Move your butt. They're my favourite in the game, yeah. I don't know what my favourite level is in 3. I probably have one for the... Oh no, cropped out. I mean, obviously, this level. Rude. Mm -hmm. uh, 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 rude. Change the water city are quite fun, yeah. I think with Lud's Gate, it's the fact that the... The, um... Oh. <laughs> it's the fact that the... There's that underwater bit. <sighs> Like, up to that bit, I think it's pretty good. But that bit is just really quite confusing and tricky. Go away. <sighs> Sorry, Lizard. Um, so I'm definitely you next week. We'll have to chat. In what day to meet? Yeah, definitely. If you're in Chroma, I'll definitely have to come and see you for like an afternoon or something. That'd be nice. Um, no idea how I'm gonna come up with my top five levels of TR3. Are you gonna do a video or something, Laurie? Or are you just gonna? Is that just for you? I don't know what mine would be. I mean, Madu be Gorge, obviously. <laughs> is this right? Am I going the right way? I think I am. But we will save it because. This, see, this is a, one of the things about this level. Like, you... Even on PC, you can't really save mid-swing, can you? So you end up doing all this, but then you can accidentally get caught on fire. And so you drop into the water to not be on fire. But then... You're fucked. <laughs> yeah, it's not fun. You can quick save one piece. Yeah, but it's hard to like quick save. I suppose you could just hold down action, couldn't you? But mm, what are my favourite levels of three? I suppose. I mean, Temple Ruins is pretty iconic. I think um, Coastal Village is gorgeous. Uh, I think. I would might I probably would say Aldwych actually. I I it is quite long and comp no Oh shit. Swing, 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 swing. It's quite convoluted, but I think I just really like the kind of there's a lot of backstory there, isn't there, with like the damned and all that. And I just really like the atmosphere of it. Uh What about Are there any Nevada? I think <gasps> oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and obviously, I mean, City, I probably would rate City quite high, because I love Sophia, and I also think that's quite a fun boss fight, like, it's like, I like that it's not, you know, they try to do a bit, some different things in this game, like the fact that you have to, you can't just shoot her, you have to be more strategic. 
Um, I don't mind specifically I'll set this one. Yeah, I mean this one is it's a big pain. <laughs> uh, say the best stuff to tier three, the first officer each set segment. Yeah, I can see that. And of course, if you go into the menu and save and then load and immediately grab, I think it works. Yeah, it probably would. But um, uh, it's just a bit of a pain, isn't it? And then on consoles, you have the limited save crystals, which yeah, not fun. Do we go down here? There we go. See, these, they're just some goodies, aren't they, over there? I don't know if we can go up that way. We could go get them, I suppose. Just for the hell of it. And pick up. Yes. I'm going to save because we'll probably fall in the water. Even though I think you can like, you can glitch your way back to the back up by like diving through a corner. Oh, blades! No, thank you. Found the secret by complete accident. <laughs> yeah, that's usually what how, how it works, isn't it? Like. You'll be desperate, you'll be stuck and trying to figure out what the hell to do, and then you'll find a little secret area and like, oh, this is what I do, and there's just a secret. You're just like, great. I wasn't looking for a secret. I was looking for the solution. <laughs> Oops, um. Mainly because it doesn't look like a secret, yeah. But they never do. More of these fire things, great. And save again. I am save scumming, but oh, hydrate, Asha! Thank you. I will hydrate again. Yeah, hope you've had a good day today, Ash. Are you at work or if you just been chilling? I'm glad that um, you liked your <laughs> milkshake sound command. Maybe I'll have to add it to mine. I have got I have got some planned for when I do my celebration stream. So. You'll, I'm sure you, no, oh bugger, oh, I'm sure you'll have fun playing with those, so. <laughs> I mean really, who invented this place? Let's put, let's put blades in the middle of a waterfall, just so if it, on the off chance someone decides to canoe through it, they'll get decapitated. I will do it again, JP, cheers. Working day, but it's quiet because I'm working. I noticed. Oh, okay, that's good then. At least you weren't too busy. <coughs> Excuse me. Right, here we go. The end of the milkshake sound. I can't believe you wanted that. <laughs> that's so funny. I mean, uh, <laughs> I just did a faux rider whistle one if you want one of them. Or, <laughs> or what? I actually. Did make a WAP one for Zenriko, so I'm sure people will have fun playing that on his chat. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> Damn right it's better than yours. I could teach you, but I'd have to charge. There is a small fee for this service. <laughs> what has become a reality? Sort of. You'll find out soon enough. Everyone will. Oh, right, we have to go over there, don't we? Oh, um, by the way, Ash, I've managed to install stream elements, so I, hopefully I'll have it all sorted out by the time I do my celebration stream, but I'd quite like to do like, all the sounds and the alerts and stuff on there, so hopefully it'll look better, but we'll see. We'll see how I get on with it. 
This version of Ara can shake my milk. I bet she can. <laughs> Honestly, dirt. Yeah, this bit as well. This is another bit where it's just tedium. And that you can't really save it. I mean, I suppose you can, but... <sighs> oh, no. <laughs> Bugger. Yeah, it sounds, sounds like a voiceover for a financial services company. I know it does, doesn't it? Like you could hear it on the radio. Maybe that's that should be my new job. I should try and become a voiceover artist for boring insurance companies. I mean, if it if it paid good, hell yeah, why not? Oh, the one minute war wall. Oh, yes. Here we go, kids. Now might be a good time to go get a drink or a snack because it's going to take me a while. I wish she could, like, in AOD, like, she can climb up diagonally. That would be such a great feature in this game, but no. Sadly not. Do you want a wee hand setting them up on stream elements? Oh, I mean, yeah, that would be really nice of you, Ash. I don't know if I'll do it tonight. Maybe we'll, we can talk on Discord or something and um, and arrange it. But yeah, I'd definitely appreciate it. I mean, it doesn't seem too hard. Like, I've, I've got, like, the the activity in my chat already in my OBS, so it's just a case of, like, doing all the, the things for the sounds and stuff. So it's only really that, it's only really that I want to do. I suppose I could do, like, a countdown timer, maybe. I know a lot of people like that. But, um... I don't know. I'll have a play with it and then I'll, I'll let you know. But yeah, thank you. Man, this tune made by the Blades is banging. Yeah, it really is, isn't it? Not as good as the funky Blades in TR2, though. They, that's, that's my jam. <laughs> oh, save it so we don't have to do that again. <sighs> yeah, I can jump on and show you. It doesn't take long. I helped Gunsy on Friday as he moved his over to SE. Yeah. Oh, excuse me. Yeah, um... Well, thank you, Ash. That's very kind. Uh, we... Oh, no. And that... Ha ha ha! You're not going to flatten me, bitch. Right, um... Oh, shit, another one. No! Oh, bugger. <laughs> Damn it. I should have guessed this. Always, there's always another boulder, isn't there, in this bitch. Um... Uh, right, got to head off to start my stream. See you soon, bud. Oh, okay, Wolfie. Uh, it was lovely to see you. I'll probably pop in later and say hello. But yeah, thanks for stopping in. Um, also can show you how to do a time on stream as well. That's what I use. Oh, okay. Yeah, that would be really nice, Ash. Thank you. Yeah, see you, Wolfie. Have a, I'll, I'll pop, try and pop in your stream later. Right, and... Duck. <sighs> Good to see you. And duck again, eek. Right, oh, Jesus Christ. How dramatic. Oh god, of course there's another one, holy crap. And is there going to be another one up there? I bet there is. I don't even remember where I'm supposed to go. And the floor's just randomly on fire, because of course it is. There's four in total, wonderful. Spectaculant. Eep. <sighs> Goodness me. Right, uh, now we're here. Let's save again. And climb. And shimmy. I think this is just why I'm not a big fan of this level. There's a lot of this sort of stuff which is just kind of tedious, isn't it? And that combined with the kayak is just not fun. No. 
Now don't fall in the water, there's a good girl. <sighs> dear. Dear, we might even actually get to Antarctica tonight, that'll be fun. Oh, why were you timed out for one second, Storm? Oh, was it a, did you post a link? I thought I turned them off. Was it a link, Storm? You have to let me know. I think they, for some reason, I, I did turn it off, but it still does it. <sighs> Can you actually even turn it off after try it? Oh, if you, um, or if, if there's any, oh, Ash, actually, you could do it, maybe. If you do permit, you can permit Storm to post a link, if you don't mind. Um, so he doesn't get banned. Not banned, uh, message deleted. Yeah, it's really annoying that it does that. How can you delete the quotes, lol? What quotes? What do you mean? I have got a quote thing, haven't I? I have a quote that says, called quote. Oh, <laughs> I think, I don't know, I guess you'd have to do it in your stream labs, I think. you guys see it now? No, you might have to post it again, Ash. Yeah, I'm not sure why, how to turn that off, actually. I'm sure I did, but it's just a Twitch clip. Oh, okay. Um, I'm not sure why, if there's a way to actually stop it doing it. It's really annoying. Um, oh, thank you, Ash. Hang on, let me just climb this ladder and we'll have a look at it. Yeah, that is. That is such a, a Tomb Raider trope, isn't it? Thank you for the clip, Storm. It's amazing. Yeah, that always is. They never. They always come in pairs, don't they? Damn it. Damn boulders. Oh, hey. Ouch. Oh. Gross breath. I think I've got quotes, I think. People have to check, type in exclamation mark quote and see what comes up. I think I have them, I can't remember now. My dogs are going mad. Where is, there's a lever isn't there somewhere? I have the textures gone weird, is it just my face? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I don't know why I said that. Yeah, I don't think there are many though, so if I say something new. <sighs> That is the worst sound ever. Who the hell made it? They need to be punched in the throat. That's just horrible. <laughs> ears, yeah, <laughs> no. Oh, my ears are perished. Yeah, here we go. Right. Oh, it's going off hype again. Now we can go down the drain, so to speak. <laughs> Loud noises, yeah. It's, it, that is like the worst noise. And also the squeaky doors in Tomb Raider 1. Just not pleasant, are they? Not pleasant on the ears. Before. I don't know if there are any more JP, there might only be that one. I think the first two are just ones I randomly put in anyway, just to try and like see if it worked. Oh god, see this bit is a real bitch because she just lose so much health. Alright, let's see if we can do it without breaking our spine. Okay, that wasn't too bad. 
Oh bloody Mary. <laughs> oh, I did say that once. I do like to say Bloody Mary, it's fun. I think I added it because I'm pretty sure Nismo, there was a quote I said and he was like laughing his head off at it. I think it was something to do with Winston in the tier we were playing. He said, I called him an old bastard because he said he set dogs on us or something. <laughs> I can't remember now, but go away. Now, where is the lever? Which is under here. Excellent. <laughs> oh no, I hear a crocodile. No. <sighs> Ouch. Oh, for God's sake. Thank goodness. Pull the lever, cronk, cronk lever! Yay! Okay. 90% of video games these days. Zzz, yeah. <laughs> Here we are. Oh, I ran out of my ammo. I should have saved them. Because that's useful for Kuna. Right, I'm gonna just save it, and then I'm gonna go on a quick break and get another drink, and then we'll be right back. Just save it. Bad boy, yeah. <laughs> Bad boy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Only one secret. Yeah, I remember. Anyway, yeah, let's um go back to this. Uh, yeah, I'll be right back. I'm just going to get um a drink.
Right, hello, I am back. Can you hear me and see me okay? If you can. All right, let's go back to Tomb Raider 3. Let me know if it all looks good, sounds good, etc. Puna. Okay, here we go. <coughs> what I wonder what that was then. It's a dead man. I love that. Oh, he's still got me, you bastard. Rude, really, honestly. Okay, great, thanks, guys. Oh, actually, I completely forgot to do this. Um, Let me just show you guys. Uh, I want to show off the logos I've made. Um, Well, this is the one I, sh I... I just wanted to see what people think. So this is the one I showed off last time, which I think was the best one. I've just done several different versions of it, and I wondered what people think. So this is the original one. And I, I I like it, but I don't know if it needs something else. So I tried doing playing around with the backgrounds. This is the same one, but with like a background. So, and I sort of like the kind of blue sort of aesthetic is like what my channels have kind of got, I guess. So, um, and then this one is kind of like more merged together, but with a black background. Because I think like how big would it be? It'd be like that big, wouldn't it? Yeah. And then this one, I do quite like this one actually. But I don't know, I just wondered what people think. Since I've got a bunch of you here, so let me know. But yes, yeah, so this is the original one. Basically the idea is it's the 13, and then the E is like mirror image kind of thing, so 13 Elysium. Um, which is quite simple, but I think it works. But <laughs> um that one's good. Uh I think the third or the first or third one. So this one. Or this one you you're saying, JP? Yeah, I don't know. I might even do a few more, but I think I'm going to stick with this design, and maybe play around with the colours and the backgrounds and stuff. But um, yeah, maybe I'll put them in in the chat or something. Uh, Discord. Um, I like two and four. Okay. Oh God, <laughs> you like the exact different ones to JP. Uh, the blue background one, or the last one, would be my favorite. Oh, really? Yeah, I mean that. These are. This is just that one, but with the background. So, um, I like it uh, as in the background. I like the one with the black background. Oh, cool! Oh, thank you guys. Well, yeah, I just thought I'd show some people. Maybe I'll post them in Discord and see what people think. But I might even do a few more actually. But I want to kind of get it all set up for my hundred followers stream, just so I've got my my new look kind of thing but um yeah thank you for your feedback okay let's go back to tr3 let me know if you can see it all good i always get a bit paranoid that it's gonna f up mid transition <laughs> yes yeah, so now we are in the temple of puna which is a very creepy place we don't really get much backstory on him do we apart from that he's like a god kind of thing. Oh, this room's a bit of a bitch, isn't it? Uh. Oh shit. Well, I went right into it like a moron. Is it safe here, do you think? Just about. I'm so excited to see what you can create for me. Oh, well. Um, I'll probably do a bit of work on that tonight and tomorrow, Leyland, and I'll send you it. Oh, no, I'm too slow. Uh... Oh, God, this is such a tricky, tricky bit. Quick, push it, push it, push it! <sighs> okay. And we'll save. Um, in the Polynesian narrative of the... Uh, I'm going to butch this. To, to a Motus archipelago in the South Pacific, Puna is the king of the Hiti uh, Marama or, or of the Vavu, depending on the story. Yeah, isn't he like, is it is this character based off the actual, whatever he is, is he like a god or something? A king? Yeah. 
I thought he was sort of based off something actually from Polynesian kind of culture or history, I should say. Um, I'm working on my stream stuff tonight. I just in the quote thingy. Yay! This part took me time. I saved after pressing the buttons. Yeah, I think that's the wise thing to do. Oh shit! <sighs> they even took damage there. Quotes are a lot of fun. He's the king in. He's a king in myth. Yeah, not a lizard though. Oh well, when lizards anything to do with him, Laurie? It sounds weird, but um, I'm sure. I heard something about it, I don't know. Eek. Oh no, I need to pull the sound press, don't I? Shit. Shit, shit, shit. Quick. <laughs> That's handy. No, we don't want to get spiked. It's not fun. Google search found on Wikipedia. All oh, right, yeah, I'm because uh, I was saying earlier. I don't know if you were here, but um, uh, there's this uh, a YouTuber called Ink Ribbon, and he did a like a facts video on TR three, and those lizard creatures that you fight, I think, are called dragonets, and they're all female, and there's there's something to do with Puna. I'm sure they are like not the actual mythological one or the king, whatever it is. Eek. No. Oh no, shit, wrong way. Oh, I can't get it, never mind. Really, you still got me, you bastards. Go away, go away. Go away and stay away. There we go. <sighs> Indeed. Oh, he dropped a mid kit. That's nice. No, he didn't. This is just his pipe. <laughs> um, I've got to pull out the block when I did this. Powered all my way through the levers. Yeah, I didn't know about that. I did it the hard way. <laughs> yeah, it's the. It is a little bit sneaky, isn't it? I'll look. Oh, okay, thanks, Lori. Oh, whoops, um... Here we go! Yes, please. I'm not sure what weapon's best for Puna. I would say the Desert Eagle, so maybe we'll get enough clips in here, because I did use them all up earlier. Oh, well, there's quite a few, so maybe we will. Excellent. Excellent! Uh, it's a cleverly done puzzle, though naturally the player will find a way around it rather than find a way to stop the threat of me. <laughs> yeah. How much did we just get for the Desert Eagle? 30, oh that should be enough, shouldn't it? I don't really know what else I can use, I don't have the Uzis. I used about 3 rockets against Puna, oh really? Have we got, how many have we got? Because I used them all up against that T-Rex, it literally took like 20. They only got 2. And I might want to save that for later. Oh, Croft Ride, hello! Uh, well, Mama, Ri Mama Rider, Raider, she has a lot to tell me today. Sorry, we had a long conversation, but I'm back. What did I miss? Did the flare work on the T-Rex? Yeah, it did. What well, sort of did? It like... It sort of... I stood still and I threw it and it kind of was distracted. And then it kind of like... Ran away, but then I was staying still and... Yeah, I don't know. We'll have to try it again one day. I think it did get distracted by it, so... Yeah, it's strange. Um, 
50 or 60 would be the best at the end. What for, um, yeah, for Willard, isn't it? Oh, hello, Liv. How are you? Happy Tuesday. We're just about to have a fight with Puna. So I will save. What, else, what other weaponry have we got? See, the grenade launcher, I think, would be too slow. I don't know if you can even jump and shoot with this, can you? I think we could try it. Suck it, Puna. Ah, <laughs> oh, excellent. Hooray, we did it. Mute. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <It's> the, uh, <laughs> Jesus, fuck, this one took me a long time to beat. Oh, did it? I think it's probably best with the Desert Eagle, but I want to save that for the last boss. Um... Happy Tuesday here in South Africa. It's National Women's Day, so all the women here and Lara have much love to you. Oh, lovely. That's cool. Uh, this boss is a fucker here. Yeah. Right. Well, now we are on to Antarctica. Off we go to colder climes. <laughs> In base. Dead air, man. We gotta get down. This is too much. This cutscene is kind of hilarious, actually. Hold on back here! An ancient man. Yay. <laughs> She's just like, see you, dude. R.I.P. So, an interesting thing about that cutscene: the helicopter. I'm pretty sure is the same one at the end of uh, at the end of the city level. So that's why I think like maybe Willard was working with Sophia, because um, like if London is the last section in the game, like like say the canonical story then at that point Lara would have the other artifact, so if he put like Lara and Sophia against each other, whoever was left would have all of them and then bring it to him kind of thing. This is my little th fan theory, it's probably a load of rubbish, but... Yes, here we are, Antarctica. Lovely and cold. Apparently Lara doesn't need... Uh, full gloves on, or a hat. She's just that hardcore. <laughs> but yeah, um... Oh, so she couldn't really help him. Yeah, I mean, fair enough. Uh, these F&B cuts are really good, especially for 19, uh, 98. Yeah, I think... Um, I'm not sure how they look on PC, the PC version. Because they um, aren't fully rendered, but... Not fully rendered, they're just a bit weird looking, but... Okay. So there are three secrets. I think there's one in this cabin, isn't there? And then there's one in, like, on the boat. And somewhere else, but we'll try and find them. We, uh, I miss FMV cutscenes. Yeah, they don't do them anymore, do they? They're all, um, in-game, I suppose, aren't they? Which I suppose does offer some advantages, because then you do, like, you can then, like, have, like, if you have, char uh, if you have character changes, who changes their costume, you can then have the different costumes in it, which is cool, but, yeah, they don't look as good, do they? Uh... 
I love the cutscenes in this game, my favourite in the series. Yeah, I love them. Uh, Tekken 2 FMVs! Oh my god, Ash. Yeah. What was your favourite Tekken 2 ending? I don't know what mine would be. I mean, obviously I love Anna, so anything Anna. Hers is pretty pretty funny. Um, I also like Angels. That one's really cool. Uh, but yeah. Those were like, that was all the rage, wasn't it, back in the day with the fighting games. So that was your end, your reward for completing completing an a arcade run. Right, here we go. Gone since 2006. Oh, really? Shit. Yeah, it's a shame. I did like that they brought this outfit back for uh, Rise of the Tomb Raider, that I actually would play through the whole of Rise wearing it, because it's like the best outfit. How much shotgun have we got? Let's see how many this kills. Well, how many kills, how many shots it takes. Ouch. Okay, good. And now we're out of, out of bullets with the shotgun. Oh yeah! Did you get that all sorted out, Prof Rider? With your with the the double plumbers and stuff. Oops, okay, ouch. Yeah, how suspicious Willard's men are trying to gun Lara down. I wonder why they're doing that. Uh, prop Anna or Nina's FMVs that made me want to know them. One in the graveyard. Yeah, that's Nina's one, isn't it? That's actually a really good one. Yeah, um, yeah, I really like that one. It's also really cool because it's like they don't even speak, but it gives you so much sort of story without having to say anything, which I really liked. Um, the endings in Tekken 7 are really naff, most of them. It's sort of, it's really, it's a shame how far they've fallen. Go on, go away. Damn it. Oh, hydrate from uh, Liv, of course. We've got some orange and mango on the go tonight. Tekken still yet to go down that rabbit hole. Oh, you totally should, Dan. Do you uh, like any fighting games at all? Um, I mean, I grew up, that was like, that and Tomb Raider were like my two, two sort of franchises I've followed since I was super young, so I, I would always love them. Oh, I forgot to open that door. Oh well. Oh, whoops. Um, oh, back we go. Not behind the door, silly. So I'm not sure we can go down and we can go up. I think we need to go up first to press the button to release the boat, don't we? Did you do a dramatic reading today? I promised a heavy metal lyrics and I have something in mind. I did do one earlier of Whistle by Flo Rida. We can do another one if you like. Maybe we'll do it at the end of the stream though. So I'll, I'll probably go a little bit longer. But um, yeah, by all means, redeem it if you like. I'm so certain this does it. Okay, fair enough. Uh, I love Street Fighter and Mortal Kombat. Yeah, I like Mortal Kombat a lot, actually. Um, the new one's really good, MK11. Never played many fighting games either. It's, it has it lead to me and my sister arguing. Oh, okay. Yeah, they, I used to play with my brother a lot, and we used to get mad at each other for kicking each other's butts. <laughs> Ah, secret number one. Ooh, that crystal. Oh, it is moving. It looked like it wasn't moving for a second. <laughs> okay, he, he let me have a look. <laughs> so many. So my confession is I've never played these Antarctica levels. Really? Have you never finished TR three? Then no way. You need to get on it. They're not that bad. I mean, they're kind of tricky, but they are the last levels, so you kind of expect it, I suppose. <laughs> 
I mean, I understand TR3 is kind of mean sometimes. I don't know, what would chat say? Would you say that TR3 was harder or TR4? Because I think TR4 is quite hard. I do like it, but I think it's probably because that's also one I haven't played as much as the others, so maybe I'm just not as familiar with it. Um, Right, what are we doing? Hey! Don't get me. No, rude. Uh, Love Streets of Rage. I've never played that one. Um, TR3 is the entire game in the main fraction I've not finished. Oh my goodness. If you need to change it, you need to do that. It's not that bad, but it is. You can do it, I believe in you. Yay. No goodies. TR4 is confusing because of the levels layout, yeah, that's probably ha what I'd say about it, I find it tricky because like you backtrack through so many levels and sometimes it's hard to keep track of what you're doing. Um, 3 is definitely harder, ooh, and it's just too long, yeah. More Combat was one of those franchises that inspired the age rating, oh absolutely. I mean they kind of had to, didn't they, with the, the violence? So I didn't open that door, so I'm going to have to go back this way. But I hear someone. Or is far more confusing. Yeah, I think it is. I mean, I have played it a few times, but I haven't played it nearly as much as... Maybe it's just because I've played three so many times. I know what I'm doing, roughly. But with four, I'm, I'm a little bit fuzzy. So when we get round to playing four, I'm sure you'll enjoy me getting stuck. And being, being bad at it. <laughs> Good. Four is harder in my opinion in just 20 levels and I find it difficult to even put time put the time into it. Yeah, there's definitely some tricky parts. I mean it uh, I'd say definitely four and three are the are the the mummy and daddy of difficulties in this in the series, I'd say. But I think Chronicles is fairly straightforward. Two I think most of the difficulty comes from the human enemies. At least to me, there are some complex levels, and then one I think is sort of one I think is the most balanced in my opinion. I think it it feels difficult, but not like uh, unfairly difficult. It kind of feels like it naturally excels. Uh, it naturally goes up in difficulty as you progress, so it's kind of like balanced in my opinion. Um, I just save again. I'm gonna just turn my lot and let me know how it looks. It's getting a bit dark in here. Oh, bloody, come on. Look at this stupid thing. Work. Work for it. Work for me. Okay, my light is on a turn on for some reason. Great. Oh. Okay. Why are you being a bitch? Maybe the lead's fucked. There we go. How's that? <laughs> Let me just check out the chat. Oh no, it keeps dying. Okay, we'll just leave it. <laughs> uh, tier 4 is long and towards the end it gets frustrating, but I felt tier 3 was punishingly difficult. Yeah, it is. I think it's definitely got some moments that are a bit tricky. Why won't this work? Come on, light. Work for me. There we go, are you going to be alive? For some reason it keeps dying, okay, we'll just leave it. It's being a bitch. Um, but the boss sucks with 4-2. I don't even remember the bosses in that one. I suppose like, you have the, like, what is it called? The uh, the bull. That's not really a boss, is it? It's more of an obstacle. Oh, shit. Damn it, I wanted to jump over there. I'll try that again. Um... I remember I was impressed by the engine improvement tier 4 and cool stuff. Yeah, I mean, it looks amazing, that game, doesn't it? It really, like, they push the PlayStation graphics to the max and they, it looks gorgeous. Um, but we'll see. I think on my most last playthrough, I actually got through it a lot quicker than I had before, so maybe I'll be okay, but we'll see. <laughs> yeah, but in one her model, it's very meh. Yeah, 
Um, but then that was the first game, wasn't it? TL One is Perfection. I actually would agree, to be honest. I think that's probably the best game, even though it's not my favourite game in the series. I do think it's, like, pretty damn perfect. Oh, hello, Chris. How are you? How are you feeling? Are you okay? Hope you're doing good. The boss is pointless. That's very true, yeah. Um... We're planning to play TF1 next. Next will be uh, Lost Artifact. If I can get it working, we'll see. Um, the lovely art creator sent me some things to install, so we will try it. Yeah, cut in the boat. Excellent. But yeah, I think we'll probably go up to at least Angel of Darkness. I'd love to play the LAU games as well, but I haven't got them on Steam. So I suppose they're probably not that expensive though. Maybe up to Underworld, we'll say. Um, but hopefully by then I'll have sorted out like a capture card and stuff. I oh, know, reverse, reverse, here we go. Headache still crushing my skull and 38 degree fever and still not on my brain. Weak as newborn, but still like, oh gosh. Take it easy, Chris, you know, stay hydrated and just chill out. Get the other Chris to look after you and pamper you, because you definitely need it. <laughs> But yeah, thanks for stopping by. Oh, whoops, um... Is there a secret here somewhere as well? Oh, for fuck's sake, Lara, move your butt. I'm trying to remember where they are. There's one in the cabin. Will she jump out here if I try? I bet she won't. Oh, uh, anyhow, guys, head off now. I have to finish moving everything into my back. See you tomorrow. Oh, okay, Dan. Have a good luck with it, and I'll see you soon. Um... Uh, I can help with the arc sent to ultimate. Yeah, that's, she sent me some stuff, so I'll have to try and play with it, but... Why don't my stupid lamp work? It's so annoying. I wish it would work, because it's getting a bit dingy in here. Maybe the cable's effed up. Just give me a second. I'm going to just try something. Let me just... I'll be right back. She got it to work. Hope that looks better. Um, secret is above you. Yeah, there. Oh, okay, thanks, uh, Crop Rider. Um, he offered to walk my pup because I can barely lift my ass from anything. Oh no. Yeah, take it. Uh, take it easy, Chris. Um, yeah, speedy recovery. Uh, did she send you D G Voodoo too? Oh, I don't know. To be honest, I just downloaded it. I haven't even looked at it. To be honest. Um, how do we get to the secret here? Do we have to, like... I don't think she'll jump out there, will she? I think I have to climb up somewhere else from what I remember. Where's the actual bit? Oh, if we... I wonder if I can park the boat and probably can't, can I? Back next to the gap? Okay. We oh no. It's in the hole before the platform. Can she jump out here? I bet she won't be able to, will she? Oh, for God's sake, really? How do you get love? Maybe she's not close enough. Yay. <laughs> no, it's. I think it's right, Croft Ride. I think I remember it. I wasn't sure you had to go back to like another snowy bit, but I think this is right. I, mean, I hope it is. <laughs> oh, 
That isn't right, though, is it? Damn it. Oh god, did I even see him? <laughs> wow, just a pit of cold water to die in. How cruel. I'll create it back in. Oh, we can just get it there. So can't, we can't be asked to get that rocket thingy. Oh, whoops. I only played this last year and I remember nothing, oh no. I mean, it's sometimes tricky, isn't it, we're trying to remember everything, but, um... Yeah. I sort of vaguely know what I'm doing, but sometimes it's like... I get things muddled up, I'm like, oh, there's a, like, a, a trigger switch here, isn't there? And it's like, no. <laughs> Just remembering it wrong. Right, here we go. Let's try it again. And we will save this time so we don't fail. Yeah, we'll go a little bit longer. Maybe we'll try and finish this level. We'll see how, how I how we get. And save. Well, so probably next stream we'll be able to complete it. Um, oh no, I should have slid, shouldn't I? Turn, bitch. <laughs> yeah. Oh my gosh, I was listening to the, because um, Jill is in DVD, isn't she? Or, and I was listening to the voice lines that they're going to have. I don't know why they'd have voice lines, because I don't think any of the characters do. But um, she says that line, but she doesn't say the bitch. She just says, it's my turn. And it's like, what? You didn't give her bitch. That's so sad. It's all part of the charm. It's, like, it's not like the game is like, too... You Young for it either. Fake. Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> I know. Blah, blah, blah. Come on, Lara. Jump and grab the sodding ledge. Oh, I think I'm going too f too early. It's my turn, but no bitch. Too edgy, yeah. <laughs> what is this? Yay, we finally did it. But it's so, like, hard to see in here because it's, like, just pure white. Right, one of these areas is the exit, and one of them is the secret. No, this is the exit, is it? Or is it? Oh, no, don't go. Yeah, it's good, good, though. Can hang people on hooks and show people getting murdered, but no, can't say not too <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> and it's only the leaks, but... Well, the thing is, the characters don't speak in the game. They're just running around and, like, they moan if they get hit or whatever, but they don't talk or anything. So I'm not sure why there's even voice lines, but I guess we'll wait and see. Everyone's very excited for Wesker, of course. Here we go. It's just like pure white. I can't see anything. Up oh, get now if I can play out of there. Oh, excuse me. Here we go. So we are on the right bit. <laughs> That's like Conquer Live Reloaded, sensing a majority of the stars despite being a remake of Conquer's Bad Fair Day and already M rated game. Yeah, it's weird. Or did they hope they'd appeal to kids instead? <laughs> Strange. But like, if you're going to do like a remake, or a remaster or something, why not just do it, like, be as close as possible? Oh no, where's the thing? No. No, don't freeze. Shit, shit, shit. Oh, bugger. <laughs> Damn it, too slow. Game rings are weird. Yeah, they are. Oh shit, we're back here. <laughs> Trying to think of games with weird age ratings. I guess it depends on... Because sometimes it's not because it's like violent or anything, it's because it's like got certain language in it. Or even certain actions. 
so yeah it's weird See, when the flare's gone, it's almost like invisible. You can't even see exactly where you're going at all. It's crazy. Okay, I think I'll save it here just so we don't have to do it over and over again. And save it again. There was a PSP game that got released with the an EC early childhood rating by complete accident, the game was a shooter! Oh my god! It wasn't like, <laughs> it wasn't in America, was it? Like, get kids started early with gunplay. Alright, so that's secret number two. There is one more, was the, the shed shack thing. Oops. Keep that, Lara. Oh no. Oh, piss off, dude. Rude. Oh, go away. <sighs> Goodness me. Can you see that? I mean, fair enough, like, game... Oh no, I need the crowbar, I don't know. Um, like, games should have ratings, just like movies, but then... Parents still buy their children it, and then they complain that... Like, when there's, like, a, you know, horrible thing that happens, they blame video games for it, and it's like... Why don't you blame the parents for allowing their ch child to play things that aren't in their age range? That doesn't make any sense, does it? But yeah, I think it probably, like, would desensitise someone to certain violent acts or whatever, but like you have to, you can't just blame the game for being violent, you know. Like there's an age rating for a reason, so follow it. Epic Mickey would probably have a higher rating to the game's concept art, seriously dark, oh no. Hey! Wow, he just tried to run for his life. Too bad for you, mate. <laughs> what I don't get is why Willard staff shooting Lara shoot? They would be taking her to see Willard. It is a bit suspicious, isn't it? Oh shit. I keep meaning to post actually, but I wrote a, like, a fan theory about um, Sophia in Tomb Raider and her role and maybe she had more of a role and basically the idea is is that that helicopter we just saw I think you see at the end of the London of the city devil and I thought like maybe it was like just silly but maybe Willard was hoping that Lara and Sophia would sort of one of them would finish the other one off and then he'd sort of the, the survivor would bring all the artifacts to him which is maybe why his men are trying to kill her because they know that she's got all the stuff, so he wants it, so he's like, just shoot the bitch. Or maybe they're trigger happy because um, of what's happened. We'll see something in a minute, but... I don't know what that button actually does, to be honest. But, um, why are those dudes hostile, hostile to our MG said the same moment I was writing it all. <laughs> so they make me track pieces before she can find out. Yeah, probably. I don't know, it's weird, isn't it? I guess they had to have some enemies in the level, like... I don't even know what I'm doing. Where am I going? I don't remember. Oh, excuse me. I think we'll have to call it an evening in a minute because I'm a bit knackered. <laughs> Great minds, though, yeah. It is an interesting question. I mean, obviously, we don't. The story's not as, like, fleshed out as it could be. Like, 
I assume she's in contact with, with Willard, like, during each, each section, he must tell her where to go. And then be like, okay, now you've got them all, meet me in Antarctica. Oh, I think the crowbar's here, isn't it, actually? I mean, she's wearing a jacket with her company logo. Yeah, it's weird, isn't it? Very suspicious. I can't believe I haven't got the Uzis. I must have missed them, the pickup for them, which is sad. I wonder if we'll get them here. We can use the pistols that enemy can't too hard, though. Take them off her, kill her or she can stip him, I guess. Yeah, maybe. They were in London. Oh, so you can't get them again, can you? That's annoying. Oh well. See, we even did Nevada first, and you still have got that weapon. Uh, we just have got that weapon back, which is annoying. And here we go. Here is the crowbar. Um, the fact that they have a chopper come in, pick her up, yeah, maybe the part was their mate and they're pissed off that, um, about her for letting him die, yeah. <laughs> Health! Oh yeah, I'm nearly dead, thank you. Um, I need to shower tonight and I can't be fucked, I want to get up, I just want to get into bed but I have to work really early, Oh. We don't have to, I'll probably be get, signing off in a minute anyway, Layla, so you can go if you like. But it was, I mean, it's lovely to see you, always lovely to see you. Hey. Oh shit. Oh, that was wrong. Did you guys, did you seem to drop anything, which is annoying. In the big room after the button maze. Did you guys just get the crowbar? Oh, also, this is an interesting thing, look. So, in this game, this artifact is called Aura Dagger, and this one is the Element 115, but in the PlayStation version, this is the Aura Dagger, and this is Element 115, which makes more sense, I think. But, um... So, I'm not sure how they messed that up on the PC version, but oh well. Eek. I'm not leaving you all. <laughs> all right, we're only. I probably let's just go a little bit further. Maybe we'll do that room with the cr where the crowbar is. Oh, actually, we can go back and. What are we doing? We can't get the secret with the crowbar, can we? We have to get a key. But maybe that's in this bit. I'll, I'll just have a look. I can't quite remember to be honest. Oh, well, we'll take this eagle clips. Thank you very much. Yeah, thank you everyone for being here with me tonight. It's lovely to see everyone. Um, yeah, there's a bit up there, isn't there, with a crow path. Let's have a look. What time have you got work tomorrow, Layla? I, I work early um, on Wednesdays. Sadly. And I always seem to wake up before my alarm as well, which is really annoying. Hopefully, I will have a new job soon, touch sure. on Oh, see, for some reason she drops the crowbar. I don't know why she does that. Always a good time on your streams. Oh, thanks. I'm not... Uh, probably... Let's just do this bit down here, and then I think I'll call it an evening. Oh, but we've got the nice puzzle element. Maybe we'll, we'll listen to this. And then... Oh, actually, Croft Rider, didn't you want to redeem a... Um, Dramatic reading. We could do that to end with if you like. Or we can just do it next time. What actually is in this room? Oh no, it's just this. That's it. This is just for the the fuel bit. Yeah, should we do that? And then we'll call it an evening. 
because I do like this track. This is, I think this is the puzzle element, isn't it? It's gorgeous. TR3 did have some lovely tracks, to be fair. Only 9 till 2 tomorrow, and then I'm streaming once I'm home, hopefully. Oh, lovely. Well, I'll definitely catch your stream. Oh, for fuck's sake. Go away! I'm on your side, so. Very rude. Yeah, we can do the, um. The, uh, boiler thing. Do, 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 do. Nope, no, whoops. Damn it. Don't freeze. Okay, there we go. Love the music in this game. Yeah, there's some great tracks on there. It's just gorgeous. So, is it... It's... I think it's... Green, red, green, red. Is that on red? No. Here you go, green. Go on then. Listen to the Team Radio Suite on Spotify app recently, absolutely beautiful renditions. Yeah, I mean, they are really nice, aren't they? Whoops. Um, I haven't listened to all of them yet. I think I only listened to Team Radio 1. I'd definitely like to check out the rest of them. Oh wait. It's... Yeah. Is it this is either the right way I've got to do the other two instead? I can't remember. Oh no, that's right. Okay, cool. Okay, let's just get up here and we'll call it an evening. Um or maybe the dudes shoot now because they are already under the influence of the mutation. However, they still haven't turned into muscles. I was gonna say that actually, Croft Rider, that maybe they're on edge because of what Willard's been up to. And they're like, shit, you know, and they're all like gun trigger happy, but I mean, I don't know why you'd shoot Lara, but maybe it's because they know she's got the artifacts and they're like, no, stop, but then they could just tell her what's happened. I don't know. Or Willard was like, if you see her, kill her and then bring me the artifacts because I need them. There we go. That has done something. Ooh, nice. <laughs> nice shot of her forehead. That was an interesting angle. <laughs> yeah, let, let's have a let's just have a look in here, and we'll see. I mean, this looks like it's been destroyed, doesn't it? Suspicious. What's happened here? The radio's gone funny. And what is this we have here? Okay. Ah. Oh my goodness, what the actual hell has been going on? I've just met a man who may as well have been Brundlefly. Right, so... Let's just call it an evening. I'm not even sure where to go next anyway, so... But yeah, thank you everyone for being here. I'm going to say, tentatively, actually, next stream will be... I don't know, hang on, let me just... Let's just get out of this and I'll, I'll try and remember what I'm saying. <laughs> here we go. Right. Yeah, thank you everyone for being here. Such um, a rush. Oh, thank you so much, Croft Rider, for the bit. Um, I love how shocked you sound. What do you mean? What, when they see the mutant? Like, oh no, he's a mutant, yeah. <laughs> Nothing really. I just have that kind of voice. I don't ever have a much of an emotional range, I'm afraid. <laughs> but yeah, thank you so much for the bits, Crawford. Um Yeah, so um, next stream will probably be Thursday or Friday. Not sure yet. That will be the Tier Lee we were playing, which was, I think it was a uh, Venetian Adventure by Cubsy. And we might even play another one if we finish it. And then maybe an art stream on the weekend. Not sure what day yet. I'll keep everyone posted. And then I would say my celebration stream for 100 followers will probably be Monday. Maybe about six-ish. I'll keep everyone posted on that as well because that will be a good laugh. I've got some interesting things to share with people. So, um, uh, Thanks for stream. Well, you're welcome, JP. See you again, man. Thanks, Nismo. Um, oh, <laughs> thanks, Ash. Love to see you too. Thanks for the Mr. Straight Amazing Stream. <laughs> thanks, Layla. I'm glad you liked Whistle. Uh, lovely to see you, Laurie. And you too, Croft Rider and Storm. 
and just everybody. Yeah, should we see if there's anyone to raid, or should we just call it a night? There should be some people on that, should, shouldn't there, on a Tuesday evening? Let's have a look. Steve's on. Yeah, good raid, Steve. I haven't I think I've raided him for a while. Uh, there's Agent. There's Griffin. Wolfie. Ooh, Tyron. What do people think? Wolfie's playing two middle level editor. Tyron is playing Elder Scrolls. Uh, Agent's playing a two middle level, and Steve is playing Sonic Origins. So, those are your choices. Oh, actually, I didn't run down what actually happened tonight. I can check the... I think we only had the bits from Croft Rider, so... Oh, this is, the stream list isn't showing me all the hydrates and stuff. That's annoying. I'll have to sort that out. I suppose because that's through Streamlabs, is it? Oh, maybe. One with the smallest numbers. Yeah. Because Steve has got about 35 people, so it's Agent. Griffin's got seven. Wolfie's got four. Tyrant's only got one. So should we go to Tyrant? Why not? He's a lovely guy. He's been playing through a lot of different things, like Assassin's Creed and such. Um, and he's currently playing Elder Scrolls, which I keep getting mixed up with Elden Ring. And I know it's not the same thing. <laughs> Okay, yeah, let's raid him. There we go, lovely. It's actually working. Yeah, thank you so much, everyone, for being here tonight with me. It's lovely to see everyone. Uh, we'll be back Thursday or Friday. Not sure yet. I'll let people know in the Discord or on social medias. Um, and yeah, and Monday will be the celebration stream, which I'm very excited for. And I'd love to see everyone there because it's going to have some crazy things in it so <laughs> but yeah uh, say hi to i'll pop in and say hi to tyrant as well but um yeah thank you everyone and have a good rest of your week good night <laughs>